To multiply two polynomials, we distribute each term in the first polynomial into the second polynomial. For our two examples, we have a binomial times a trinomial, and therefore to find the product, we distribute both terms in the binomial into the trinomial. So to find this first product, we begin by distributing the x of the binomial into the trinomial, which gives us three products. And then because of the minus two, we then distribute negative two into the trinomial, which gives us three more products, giving us a total of six products. When multiplying a binomial and a trinomial, we always have six products. And now let's multiply. x times x squared is equal to x cubed. And then we have x times six x, which is six x squared, giving us plus six x squared. And then we have x times negative seven, which is negative seven x, giving us minus seven x. And now we distribute the negative two. Negative two times x squared is negative two x squared, giving us minus two x squared. And then we have negative two times six x, which is negative 12 x, giving us minus 12 x. And then for the last product, we have negative two times negative seven, which is positive 14, giving us plus 14. And now we combine like terms. Notice how we have two x squared terms, and we also have two x terms. Simplifying, we have x cubed, and then six x squared minus two x squared is four x squared, giving us plus four x squared. And then we have negative seven x minus 12 x, which is negative 19 x, giving us minus 19 x, and we still have plus 14. The simplified product is x cubed plus four x squared minus 19 x plus 14. Let's take a look at a second example. To find the product, we distribute both terms of the binomial into the trinomial. We begin by distributing two x, which gives us three products. And then we distribute the three, which gives us three more products for a total of six products. Multiplying, two x times five x squared is equal to 10 x cubed. And then we have two x times negative four x, which is negative eight x squared, giving us minus eight x squared. And then we have two x times nine, which is 18 x, giving us plus 18 x. And now we distribute three, Three times five x squared is 15 x squared, giving us plus 15 x squared. And then we have three times negative four x, which is negative 12 x, giving us minus 12 x. And for the last product, we have three times nine, which is 27, giving us plus 27. And now we combine like terms. We have two x squared terms, and we have two x terms. Simplifying, we have 10x cubed, and then negative 8x squared plus 15x squared is positive 7x squared, giving us plus 7x squared, and then 18x minus 12x is 6x, giving us plus 6x, and we still have plus 27. The simplified product is 10x cubed plus 7x squared plus 6x plus 27. I hope you found this helpful.